Welcome back! In the next few minutes we will walk through the rebuild of the Harrier S1100. The process is pretty much the same as the first Harrier with one new detail, it's better. So yeah, let's unbox it and install servos, camera and some stuff like an embedded video transmitter. Go take your Dremel and make some room for the transmitter and the antenna. This is how it looked like after I've been through. Flush, sexy and almost hidden. In case you use a Dragonlink transmission system like me, I took my antenna and put it into the outer wing. Then it was time to make the wing sexy. I made a copy of the shape I did last time on the old wing and applied it to the new one. With that I could take Aura cover and cut it and apply it. But before applying our cover, I wanted to reinforce the bleeding edges of the wings. As you can see, I did so with fiberglass and false tape. I hope this will protect the wings for incoming trees and branches. You know. Finally, a little silver line here on the wing tips, and then we head over to soldering the FC. After having prepared all the wires, it was time to route them through the fuse lodge. I still use the pluggable system from Mark 1 from the first Harrier I built. And of course, there's always room for one more LED. Like in the last area, I did reapply the orange lights. They are so awesome. And some decals, of course. And that's basically it. So, we are ready for takeoff? Let's go for it. That's it for this time. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you next time. And meanwhile, we got some cool videos for you you may not have seen yet.